Hi, and welcome to this week's episode of The Dashing Diner. I'm your host, Adam Martinetti. This week, we're at the Whistle Stop Cafe. So let's order something. I ordered the large brogan poutine. Now the brogan poutine comes with sausage, pepperoni, bacon, and ground beef. Now the brogan poutine is named after Brogan O'Rourke, the guy who originally put up the first poutine menu on here before it got replaced by this even larger menu. The brogan poutine was originally supposed to be called the T-Rex poutine because it had so much meat in it. Now here we go, the first bite. Oh, this is gonna be hot. Mm. The Whistle Stop Cafe opened on March 17th, 2008. When they first opened, they had 50 different kinds of poutine, which made them the largest poutine selection in the world. Within the last year, they've expanded to over 100 different kinds of poutine. That's a whole lot of poutine. Now with the poutine selection that large, you have to expect that their most popular dish is the poutine. Their second most popular dish is their all-day breakfast that they offer, well, all day. Now, of their poutines, the most popular poutine is their classic poutine, which is just your standard poutine. You got french fries, you got cheese, and you have gravy. Their second most popular poutine is their pulled pork poutine. Their third most popular, the snooky poutine. That's your, just your classic poutine with a breaded pickle on top of that. Not exactly what I'm into. Now, with over a hundred different kinds of poutine, you're going to run into some interesting combinations, such as the whoop-ass poutine, the holiday dinner poutine, the macaroni and cheese poutine, and then of course, there's Taku's Big Booty Chicken Poutine. Now, I'm not saying these are bad poutines, I'm just saying, there's some interesting combinations that are for the more uh, brave eaters out there. An observation I've made over the past four years of coming here is that I tend to find their smalls to be too small, but their larges, they're either just right or just that much too big. It all depends on the mood you're in, I guess. This all fits in with their go big or go home attitude that they have here at the Whistle Stop. Looks like today, I'm going big. So you're probably asking yourself at this point, what does the Whistle Stop offer other than poutine? Well, like I said before, they've also got all day breakfast. But along with that, they have a full menu. They have quesadillas, they have nachos, they have hamburgers, they have hot dogs, they have Monte Cristo sandwiches. They've even got matzo sticks. So they've got a full menu here that you can come and check out, and they've also got dessert poutine. Now I know we already talked about poutine, but this is dessert poutine. It's completely different. It's got funnel fries instead of regular fries, and it's also covered in things like chocolate, you got caramel bits, you got all sorts of things. They've got seven different kinds of dessert poutine here that you can come and check out. If you just want to relax and come here and have a nice cup of tea, well you can definitely do that. They've got themselves a tea room and over 50 different kinds of loose tea that you can try out. Well, I'm finally done. Now it's time for final thoughts. It was great. It was enormous. There was lots of meat. I love that. There was gravy, there were fries, and there was cheese. I love poutine. And this is a place where I go in Peterborough to get poutine. Here, they know how to do poutine right. It's the only place outside of Montreal that I've had poutine that tasted this amazing. Come by yourself and take a look around and maybe even try some of these crazy poutines they've got here. That's all for this episode of The Dashing Diner. I've been your host, Adam Martinetti. Thanks for watching this week's episode of The Dashing Diner. Don't forget to click on subscribe, like, and comment down below. And if you like this show, you might be interested in these other shows that we like. And don't forget you can stay connected with us on Facebook, Twitter, and Instagram as well.
ya. 